Hey guys, as you see, I'm on my channel here. Let's have some fun. Let's get jacked. Okay guys, it seemed that you liked week one of vlogging, so I figure why not uh, keep doing it as long as you guys want to watch it. So I'm actually thinking about going back on keto. I don't know if you guys know, but I was on keto for a while. Now there's like all new types of stuff since the last time I was on keto. So i to look at all that and see if it's actually keto because a lot of things out there that say they're keto, when you start reading the back, you'll realize they have a ton of sugar and carbs in them, even though they say they're keto. So. Uh, I don't know guys, in this video, make sure that you're commenting down below what you want to see me go do. I want to do fun things, but I want to know what you guys want to see. So let me know. Guys, this is one of the amazing things about living out here is those, I don't know if you can really see them, but those are white cap mountains in the distance, like from the, from the snow that recently came. And it's just so beautiful. Like it almost blends with the sky, but in real life you can actually see it. It's so awesome. What a feeling, now it's time for Christmas And Christmas is my favorite time of year Some people have been asking me for a room tour or a house tour or whatever I can do a room tour right now, the house isn't super clean But uh, just so you know, this is a rental house So I'm still kind of looking for a house that I might eventually want But we'll start with the room tour That's my suitcase since I just got back from a trip and that's my dresser and that's a table for who knows what reason that's where i do my laundry uh, that's my bed my fan picture of my dad i don't know if you guys have seen this do we look alike i know what you're thinking shot glasses that's not for what you think it is i actually put coins in there so they don't get all over the place candles and tissue, my watch, and my empty water bottle that I need to clean up, nightstands, uh, my Caleb dog tags, and yeah, I mean, that's the room. Hey guys, thought I'd check in. Craziest thing, it's like nine o'clock at night. And yesterday, I started noticing this floating spot in my vision. And I'm got to go get that checked out. It's the craziest thing in the world. So any of you people out there that is either an eye doctor or has ever worked for an eye doctor or knows anything about this, maybe you can tell me what this little floating spot thing is. And in that spot, it's blurry. So things are blurry in that spot. So with both eyes open, it's kind of blurry. If I close this eye, it kind of clears up. It's a crazy it's a little football-shaped spot. I don't know what that is. You guys tell me. Comment down below. Tell me what you think that is. And uh, hopefully we can all figure this out. Also, guys, before I forget, I did an interview with Mitchell. It's over on his channel. And uh, you know, I'll play a few little highlights here. I think a Visco girl is, a, is an exact representation of being that person that is super concerned with whatever the popular opinion is right now. And almost in lieu of having your own opinion on a singular subject. Right. Big facts, dude. Like, yeah, no, I, I like it. I like it. I just I haven't gotten to like the movement of it yet. I, I don't know. You should. You should. You should. Do, should. You should transform <laughs> yourself into a Visco girl. Like, I realized that, and I was like, if I want to do my own thing on my own channel, then I should do that. I don't really need to be in the videos anymore. Exactly. Big facts. Exactly. Just trying to. I, I get what you're saying. Just trying to like prosper on your own kind of. For like sure. Just, do my own thing yeah. and like not, I don't Sorry. want people to think that I'm using my kids to make my channel popular. But go check his channel out. Subscribe to him. He's a great guy and uh, he does good stuff and really deserves for people to watch it. So guys, I don't know if you remember a couple years ago, I actually had LASIK done on my eyes. I'll post a picture. Here it is. Here you go. So something weird that is going on with my eye, I'm seeing spots everywhere. And so I have to get it checked out to see what's going on with that. And hopefully it's not anything because 
I know that eye surgery for me was scary. It was like being blind for a second and like almost had a panic attack, I swear. And the recovery time was not fun either. Felt like you had like glass in your eye or sand in your eye the whole time. And so it's kind of weird right now. My eye feels dry and it's got spots and stuff. So hopefully it's nothing major. I had a fun idea today, guys. I want to interact with you guys as much as possible just because I love like communicating with you guys in any way I can. So in this video, I want you to ask me a question followed by the laughy face and then the kissy face emoji. And I'll try to answer as many of those questions as I can. So I guess the whole idea of vlogging is letting people into your lives. So just figured I'd let you guys into this part of my life. One of my things I like to do when I'm bored or at night when I can't sleep or whatever, is I like to just walk. I've been known to walk like up to 10 miles just walking. For no reason, it's just to do it. It's a good time to think and reflect and everything. And so today's Annie's birthday. And uh, I don't think you guys know, and it's not something we have ever said a lot, but I think a lot of people out there think everything comes easy. And if you guys could see how hard both Annie and Haley work, like it's classes and videos and and I know you guys like especially the ones that make videos at home are like yeah making videos are fun and they are but when you do it as much as they do it eventually turns into work turns into a little bit of a job and they do such a great job with it and they never complain and I have read your guys's comments and I know you've expressed different opinions about whether you think they film enough or whatever, but you just have to keep in mind, they do. They film whenever they can, and they really, really, really want, and I really want to put out the best stuff for you guys. So just remember that, that they're still still making stuff for you guys. Annie's still making um, music for you guys, and Haley's still making videos on her channel, and they're trying to express themselves in their best artistic way and and they're doing it for you guys so you know just remember that and you know there's people reading those comments and so just be nice and i don't mean to just to us be nice to each other there's no reason not to be and what i, I like to tell people all the time is when you left that mean comment for someone else whoever that person was did it actually make you feel any better to leave that comment probably not and it had the potential of making them feel worse. So why do it? So that's uh, that's my message for tonight. Just uh, be nice. And uh, I love making content for you. The girls are gonna continue to make content just in a different way. All right, back again. So another little insight into me is, and uh, I like to, and I, trust me, you know, I understand, you know, not everybody has a little money to give to people or whatever, but I like to go to convenience stores and buy just stuff like Snickers and stuff like that. And then as you walk down the street and you see people that might be hard, on hard times or might even be homeless, you know, just offering them a couple dollars or a Snickers bar or whatever you feel like doing. It's not like you have to do it. It's just, just seems nice. Makes you feel good. Guys, this is what my haul looks like. We got some Reese's and some chips and uh, I don't know, lots of good stuff. And I know what you guys are probably thinking. It's probably like, why don't you put the videos of you giving it to people in there? I don't know. I mean, honestly, I don't want to feel like I'm exploiting people and I don't want to film people. I've, I've really struggled with this in my videos that I've been doing on my channel. I don't want to feel like I'm putting people in that might not want to be in or using people that, you know, would be upset about being in my videos. So I try not to do that. I know. I know what you're saying. Everybody else does, but you have to decide what's right for you. So unfortunately, I didn't film all day today, but after talking to you guys last night and walking around and things is, I um, mean, it was raining then. Good thing it's not now. Um, 
I really got into the comments because I had mentioned that I was reading the comments and when I got home, I started to think about that and I was like, I have read the comments, but I don't think I've, I've read all of them. So I went and I read and you know, let's have a heart to heart. Let's, uh, let's talk about some of the stuff. One thing was I read, you know, that the question is, why am I doing what I'm doing? Why am I filming videos? A lot of you, some of you have taken a little bit of an issue with me filming with some of the people I film with. And what I would say is this, I'm filming with the people I know in LA. I had fun video ideas I thought you guys wanted to see. But the most important thing that I wanna, I wanna put forward is this. Uh, there were some comments about, oh, well, he's doing it for the money. This is actually the exact opposite of that because that was my passion. My, my thought when doing this channel was, I've spent years being able to be privileged enough to make money on YouTube. And it was, how can I give back? How can I make these videos where I kind of connect with you guys? So I was looking at challenges and connecting with some of the people out here in LA and some people like it, some people don't. What well, the idea with the vlogs was I wanted to be to be able to really connect and like possibly somehow involve you guys in the future. Like I'd even thought about going to people's houses and meeting people and talking to them about YouTube and the path and things like that. And this was what I came up with was just, you know, let me make these videos. I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna continue to make them just so you guys know. I'm gonna continue to do the challenge videos and you know, I don't know what day I'm gonna post those and how often I'm gonna do vlogs, but I would love for you guys to keep watching the vlogs and letting me know like, you know, tell me about your hometown or, or a place you've been that might be cool for me to visit. Maybe I'll try to do that. I mean, but just so you know, heart to heart, this is the opposite of me needing to make money. This is me trying to figure out a way to appreciate you guys and give back to you guys after all the years that you've watched me and my family and just say, hey, here's me. Here's me trying to say, let's, let's connect and uh, just be myself, I guess. So thanks for watching. Um, if you guys continue to watch, I'll continue to make them. But uh, comment down below on what you think about the first couple weeks. And hopefully I can keep doing this. And hopefully you guys actually want to watch it. Thank you so much for watching for so many years. See you in the next video.